down the stretch, um, you know, a couple defensive breakdowns, but did this feel any different in, in terms of looking back at the Marquette and Tennessee game? Like, do you see growth in, in a game like this still, or was it kind of the same? Uh, I see growth in it still. Uh, you know, we're continuing to improve. Uh, I, I think it's definitely different, you know, playing here versus playing, you know, on a at a neutral site. Um, it's probably going to be one of the craziest atmospheres we'll we'll play at all year. Uh, yeah, I think I think we've definitely we've shown growth still though. Was it some of the same mistakes being made today, or were there different ones? Uh, it's some of the same mistakes. Just we just gotta lock in mentally and be mentally tougher down the stretch of the game. Why do you believe you're so effective today? Uh, just I don't know. I just kind of I was just playing the game. Really, just, all it was is me playing, playing, and just trying to help my team win. Jordan, there was a stretch there when when Indiana started getting back into it. They make a couple buckets, but then like you would hit a three, and then maybe a few minutes later, you know, Ryan would hit a three to kind of stem the tide a little bit. Did you guys settle maybe down the stretch for for outside shots? Uh, I don't think we necessarily settled. I think that you know if we're shooting those, we're, we're thinking that those that's the best one, probably the best shot we'll get uh, in the offense at the time. So uh, it's just part of the game and, and playing the game. If you have an open shot, shoot it. Uh, same thing goes if you're driving, you have a, a layup or a, a pull up, do the same thing. How hard was it to get anything going in the, in the paint for you guys? Uh, I don't think I don't think it was was too hard. I mean, I didn't really I didn't necessarily notice it when I was playing. Um, I mean, I guess that would be a, a question more for you know Steve or or Malik. The guys are in the in the post a lot more than I am, so uh, I don't really notice it as much. What made re your rebounding so effective, and what was your re the team's rebounding goal coming into this? Uh, every game is just to out rebound the other team. Um, you know, for me, I just always I always just want to crash the glass and hopefully come up with the rebound. Um, the something I'm going to keep doing. I'm going to need to keep doing to help the team be successful. Uh, yeah, just at the end of the day, there's not not really a, a different message when it comes to rebounding. Everybody. Uh, Everybody should be crashing when it comes to you know defensive rebounding because uh, nobody has to get back. So just everybody should be crashing when they can. You all seem to keep Fennessey in check until that big three. What was your view on that, and why? Why do you think? Uh, he just, I think he popped back behind the screen, and uh, I think that uh, I, I was right there. I think our our man, I don't know who was behind, might have been Quan, ran into me or a screen or screener, and he just. Popped up and hit, made a big shot. As so the season were... progresses, are you feeling more, more and more like you can get the shot that you want? Um, almost when you want. I know it's probably hard to see that, you know, after you're coming off of a, a loss like today. But um, considering how efficient you were offensively today, and that seems to be growing throughout the season, are you feeling, you know, more and more comfortable that you can get the shots that you want when you want them? Uh, I think that. When it comes to that, I think I've always I've always felt comfortable. Um, I just think earlier on in the season, I just was I would force a lot when I didn't necessarily need to. I could you know play within the offense more, uh, and that's something that you know I should I just need to continue to do moving forward. Because at the end of the day, it's not just about me and scoring; it's about us winning games. So just playing within the offense and uh, uh, hopefully winning games moving forward. Obviously, you'd rather have larger leads than having to, you know, fight back and forth down the stretch. But having been in so many of those situations this season, did you guys feel a little calmer maybe in those final minutes today? Uh, yeah, at the end of the day, you know, your nerves are still, you still got all the nerves and everything. Because uh, you just do, try to do anything you can do to win the game. So uh, certainly I know we're not the only team that was feeling that. You know, Indiana was probably feeling the same way down the stretch. Uh, it's just they, they came out with the, the win. One more. Anyone? Yesterday you were saying that this is an important game because it was the next game on the schedule. Leaving here, do you feel any differently about maybe a missed opportunity? Uh, you know, yeah, we, we, let this, we let this one go. Uh, but like I said last time or yesterday, uh, now it's just next game. Next game we got to go, go into Yum and, uh, and hopefully, hopefully win that game. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks,